In dental practice today, it's so important that we're conservative in the way that we manage dental caries. We've always struggled with knowing whether a restoration is needed or not. Is the tooth surface broken down? Looking between teeth is still a big problem. With the aid of a Dignocam, we can now non-invasively image the tooth surface, so we don't need to discuss with the patient the need for x-rays. We can now get the same information in a non-invasive way using this Dignocam instrument. I think when you start to realise the different applications for this technology, it goes well beyond just identifying dental caries on proximal surfaces. It's fantastic for finding tooth coloured restorations, and today, since most restorations are tooth coloured, it's actually quite a challenge in practice to find these reliably, and this is just another excellent application for this type of system. The actual technology it's based on leverages a very long experience that most dentists already have with transilluminating teeth. The difference is now we're using just one wavelength of deeply penetrating light rather than plain white light. So the images are much clearer and they're much easier to interpret because there's less scatter in the data which, which we're getting. One of the big challenges we face is trying to identify areas of tooth decay in deciduous teeth. The Radnacam is very good at that but we've just discovered in recent times how useful it is for finding tooth coloured restorations when we're trying to remove different sorts of restorations like zirconia crowns or we're trying to get composites out of teeth. It's actually very good for seeing the boundaries between the natural tooth structure and the artificial tooth structure. Almost every dentist has used an intraoral camera and so the feel of being able to pick it up and move it around teeth is actually something that we're very familiar with. All we're doing different is using the information in a much more sophisticated way. So the learning curve is actually very, very straightforward. Hi, I'm Dr. Malcolm Duff, practice principal at Face Value Dental here in Brisbane. I'm here today talking about Dagnacam, a um, new technology we picked up about two years ago. Um, adjunct to x-rays, phenomenally um, successful, very visual. Um, our patients uh, see what we see and act on it um, better than they did before. So um, patient acceptance of um, treatment planning of the potential, the potential problems that they have and getting them to own them themselves is increased massively with Diagnicam. We find that Diagnicam is fantastic in improving patient acceptance of treatment um, as well as diagnosis. It's made a massive impact on how much work we're doing in the practice um, and how busy it's keeping the practice as well. Essentially we have a tool which is radiation free which is great for the patient. Um, there's no overhead costs and we're finding that it's providing to be a lot more accurate with its diagnosis um, as well as easy for the patient as well. With the Diagnocam, I love that they have essentially taken an old technology and completely redefined it into something new, yet it is still reassuringly familiar that you have a tool that is handled like an intraoral camera but gives you radiographic quality images which are easy to interpret and easy for the patient to understand.